Hello, Retroburn here, aka Odamus, creator of Imbacord and Blogspot.com, and this is part 7 of our Let's Play XCOM HD series. Loading game, pausing here, so I, I won't bore you with the loading screen. Okay, we're back. Research, we've got experimental warfare, but it still won't be finished until. Scientists are going to work on it for another five days. Receiving you. We'll monitor that contact, but I don't think it's related to the UFO activity. What? Eh. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. How do we do that? results were beyond our expectations and that is not a statement this council makes lightly grade a but i'm concerned about asia we'll have to do a successful we'll have to pull off an, a successful mission in, in that region fast we will be in touch commander As we continue the research into the alien weapons, fragments, and the other materials recovered from the field, we've come to realize how the aliens managed to make these substances work in conjunction with one another. With one another. While reducing the size of these components is often a challenge in itself, we decided to focus our initial efforts on a weapon more suited to deployment on our new interceptors. Oh, okay, so this, this research is for, the, for our aircraft. This cannon was designed to concentrate energy within a small target area and should be capable of punching through the armored hulls of the alien craft. In addition, we've also passed a number of interesting conceptual designs onto the engineering team. Dr. Shen seems confident that given the upgrade resources and testing facility, he can bring many of these concepts to life. Okay, so we've unlocked <coughs> excuse me, the foundry and the Phoenix cannon.
survivability is still an issue, so we'll research this one. Wow, eight days. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. Okay, nice. From what little I've seen of their technology, if the aliens were intent on conquering Earth, there's not much we could do to stop them. I'm guessing they have something else in mind. When selecting a specific jet within the hangar, you can choose to modify its current weapon loadout to best serve our needs. several reported abductions via the hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Oh man, we've got no choice but to... Difficult 
a mission that that has been labeled as uh, difficult. So it's off to Brazil we go, confirming. Brazilian authorities have requested our help, so that's where we're going next. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Okay, launching mission. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. This is a disturbing sign, to say the least. It's hard to differentiate where the organic material ends and the machine begins. It's not going to win any beauty contests, that's for sure. have to double move then.
to le the level of elevation. This mistake on my part. and a sniper made for the bridge where they will they will have a advantage in line of sight I just had a uh, placing a watch. And let's make the 
other vets. Run him down. You are running gun. Empty. Another day, engage. another successful operation. performance. Let's hope all of these operations go as smoothly as this one did. Engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. hulk of flesh and metal, driven by the alien technology, can we still call that life? We have to keep moving forward with the project, but the thought of treading the same path as the aliens is troubling. What if they were like us once? Are we just part of a continuing cycle? If this is a glimpse of our future, I want no part of it. So we can
Okay, nice. So this time around, it's not going to eat up a slot in the. It, it's not going to eat up a back backpack slot. This new body armor was developed using what we've learned oh. from the alloys employed in the alien ship. It should prove to be both lighter and stronger than anything we've used in the past. So maybe we can... The six. So it adds three more health bars. Carry a um, arc thrower. See if we can capture a live alien. No, 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 no. What the hell? Medicate. for this soldier. So we'll cut this video. Um, this has been Retroburn, aka Damus, creator of Infocord.blogspot.com, and you've just seen part seven of our Let's Play XCOM HD series. So see you in part eight, guys. Happy gaming.